podcast. It's called American Genocide. The first two episodes dropped yesterday, and we'll be dropping four more through the end of May. We also hope that you come to our booth, which is C92, uh, over in the uh, creative, uh, Home and Creative Design Building. So happy to be here, and thank you. All right, thank you, Shirley. Again, go on over, check it out. You, she's willing to free, come on over and talk to her and have any discussions. Where are we going, James? We're going to Bart. Oh, Bart, right off to Bart. Here we go. All right, thanks, Jay Jason. He's one of our roving announcers, so throughout the powwow, you guys are going to see him bring someone from the crowd out to the side and uh, say hello to you good folks. I've got right here, we're going to ask him to uh, say a few things about the Holish Parade. This is your host, Bart Pulwaki, ladies and gentlemen. Awesome. Thank you there, James. Where are all the pretty Indians at? Make some noise. Where are all the ugly Indians at? Make some noise. Ah, oh, it's about to get ugly up in here. Anyway, at 4 o'clock, we're going to have our horse parade. We're inviting all y'all to come on out. Check it out. And at 7 p.m. after grand entry, we're going to invite all the horse dancers to come on in. We have... Tashina Redhawk is inviting all the horse dancers, horse tail dancers to come on in. Tashina wanted me to express that she's your uh, current uh, Gather Nations print world, Miss Indian world. So she's inviting everybody to participate tonight. But she said she started out coming over here at the horse parade. And that's what brought her to this powwow. And from there, she went on to win the Miss Indian World, but tonight she wants to give back, and so she's inviting everybody at 7 o'clock tonight to come back out. And I'm inviting all y'all to come on out, check it out at 4 o'clock. And also, I'm the 49 stage announcer. We got some awesome acts out there at 7 o'clock, inviting everybody to come on out. We got one of Reuben Littlehead's favorite all-time groups, Common Kings, that made their way here yes, to sir. Yes, Albuquerque, sir. the land of enchantment. But anyway, I want yes, to say sir. thank you there, and thank you there. Good luck to all the dancers, singers. Have an awesome Gather Your Nations weekend. Yes, sir. Thanks, Bart. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thanks for being here today. It is my pleasure to turn the microphone over to the one, the only, Ruben Littlehead. Oh, Make some noise, yeah. guys. Welcome him here oh, to Albuquerque, yeah. New Mexico. Yeah, uh-huh, yeah. Show me some time, show me some time. Turn me up, turn me up, turn me on. Turn me up, turn me on, turn me up. I'll try that Mike one. Cast. Turn me up, turn me on, James. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Mike Cass, check, check one, one two. two. Mike Cass. Something's wrong with those mics. Mike Cass, check one, two. Yeah. Thank Mike you, Bart Pawaki and uh, Tashina Redhawk, Miss Indian World. And thank you, James Edwards. And thank you to the Osceola brothers. Holy smokes, man. I was. I was kind of tired because I drove in a long ways, had a couple hours sleep, and I came here listening to flute music, and I was about ready to fall asleep, and then Alani kind of made me feel good with her music, and then the Osceola brothers came in and rocked the house. I felt like Dr. Robert Dobek on Step Brothers. Play those drums, Dale! Yeah. Yeah, that's what I felt like, Robert Dobek. Dale Dobek, if you don't come on over here, and anyway, we're about ready to go with the drum roll call. Are we ready to go, drum group? Stand by. Gather Good Nations 2023, ladies and gentlemen, we are here live, baby. As soon as we get the word here from head drum judge Lonnie, right? Lonnie Street, I do believe. Lonnie, this is our Lonnie, you ready to go? I see you, brother. Here we go. Drum number one, make some noise. Showtime. Pine Ridge, South Dakota, by way of Lame Deer, Montana. Drum number two, Young Spirit, Frog Lake, Alberta, Canada. Drum number three, Fort Peck Sioux, from Fort Peck, Montana, Highway 2. Walking Buffalo, Walking Buffalo, coming to us from the provinces of Saskatchewan, right? Uh, easy to draw, hard to say. Howie Thompson. Drum number five, Indian Hill, Apple Valley, right? Apple Valley, C-A, Indian Hills in the house. Thunder Boys, the Thunder Boy, Thunder Boys. And over there, drum number seven, Sharpshooter. Turtle Island, Ma, the world of uh, Jeremy Worm Dearly. Welcome, Sharpshooter. 
Coming on over there to drum number eight, Iron Star Singers, Iron Star. Uh, moving our way over there by way of uh, Southern Slam. My, my Pueblo brothers, my Pueblo brothers, Southern Slam. Iron Bear, where you at? Iron Bear. All right, Iron Bear, good, good one. Moving on over here, drum number 11, War Thunder. Tommy, is that you? War Thunder. And drum number 11, Calling Eagle. Uh, from Sawmill, right? Sawmill AZ, the biggest Packer fans. Or, uh, uh, Moving on over here to Whitetail Boys. Whitetail Boys, Big Niles, good to see you. Uh-huh. Yeah, and shout out to the Grant family. I'm sorry I couldn't make it up there, Brother Tim, but uh, you know, we're gonna rock the house for Brother Tim. Ahoo. And right here, rounding out the uh, Group A singers all the way from Oklahoma by way of, uh, by way of uh, Oak Mogi, I believe. Oak Mogi, Blazing Bear. I think uh, there's only one person from Okmogi. Uh, yeah, the rest are from Sopopa. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Did I miss any drums? Did I miss anybody? Did I miss it? We all ready to go, Randy? Cricket? Uh, we're ready to rock the house here. I'm joining the button here with uh, Dennis Bowen Sr., Seneca Allegheny, Salamanca, New York. I'm also here with my brother Joaquin Charleston Hamilton. Let's turn this mic up. Mike Taz, check one, two. Mike Taz, check one, two. One, two, three. Ah, 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 ha, ah. Check, check. Ah, ah. Mike Taz. Mike Taz, check one, two. Mike Taz, check one, two. You know what, Scano? We need a sound up here. We need a sound, Mike, man. Otherwise, I'm going to call Dale Roberts. Oh, yeah, I'm just kidding. Uh, he, he said sorry, though. I, uh, where is Dale? Dale, where you at? Dale was chilling over there, smiling right now. Yeah. Looking like Dale Dobek. All right, we have a purse here found in the restroom and then uh, by Section 3, Article 9 of Chapter 4 in the MC Handbook of the Turtle Island, U.S. and Canada. I got full permission to look inside. Oh my goodness, they're KU Jayhawk fans anyway, so they're cool. I know that, they're Jayhawk fans. They got Jayhawk on their uh, keychain. There's a number on here, and the back of the number says, Catherine. Kath Regina Catherine Rosas. Rosas from North Dakota. Anyway, Catherine, we have your purse down here, and that's all I'm looking at. That's all I'm going to say, but there is, uh, yeah. Anyway, stand by for grand entry. We got a 12 new grand entry slated here. We're going to start at the top of the order showtime. Novi, we'll be coming to you for grand entry song number one. And then uh, before we start our uh, grand entry, are we going to pray before? We're going to pray after. Okay, we're going to pray after. Yeah. Cricket, before we start, though, I know we have a lot of different passing in Indian country. We have a lot of different people that have moved on to the next camp. But uh, being an MC and sometimes finding the humor in different things, I'm going to go ahead and give a quick uh, a shout out and a moment of silence to the late Jerry Springer. Moment of silence for Jerry. Cherry, cherry, cherry. Okay, thank you. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Jerry Springer, man. You know when you come home from school, you turn on TV, and every, all the other uh, non indian kids, they would watch educational programs. But us Indian kids, we'd turn it to Jerry Springer. <laughs> My test.
Yeah, we should just start a fight so we get a Jerry Springer feeling here. And uh, somebody come down here and fight Bart Pawaki. Yeah. Where's Rodney First Strike? Oh, too soon? <laughs> Mike Taz. Mike Taz, check one, two. Mike Taz, check one, two. All right, any Senecas here? Any Oneidas? Cayuga? Onondaga, Mohawk, Tuscarora, Jeez, Tuscarora's in the house. Welcome, welcome. Here we go, Ruben. I, uh, I believe we're praying after grand entry, Dennis. I believe we're going to pray after grand entry. Is that right, uh, Cricket? So I'm looking at Cricket. I'm looking at Randy. And I'm trying not to look at James, but man, I just can't help look at James. Remember on uh, Step Brothers? And uh, not Dale, but his brother, what was his name? Brennan. And Brennan had that face that uh, he said, I just want to hit it. <laughs> I just want to punch it. <laughs> anyway, we're going to start at showtime. Four starts, no V. And then we're going to kick it on over to Young Spirit on down the line. Good to see you, Jake. You got some new shirts? Me too. You want to do the, uh, the, our, our annual uh, uh, swaparoo? Uh, shirt for a shirt? Uh, what are you, uh, XL? Yeah, that's code for 2X. I'm 2X. No three, no more, though. I recently started yoga. Julius, not afraid? Julius, not afraid. Come on up. See the arena directors? All right, Julius in the house. Gathering of Nation, 40th anniversary. We are ready to sing and dance. Hi, Kie. That was uh, the owner of the purse came up, Joaquin Catherine Sage, right? Yeah, we're going to correct it. Also, speaking of shout outs, I'm calling upon Lauren Goodday. Lauren Goodday, if you're here, come on down. I have your fan special delivery from Adrian Primo. Welcome to Roy, Roy Bison, Crazy Horse Bison. Good to see you, Roy. Peva. Check, check. Women's Fancy and Jingle, we need you over here on the west side. Women's Tradition over here on the east side. Fancy and Grass over there on the south side. And then our traditional on side as well over there, we're lining up our grand entry, Randy Medicine Bear. Also, Julius Not Afraid is here, our Eagle Staff Carry, he brought my plumes down. Thank you, Julius. Scano. Yeah, Heath Hill is also here too, ladies and gentlemen. Somehow he got permission. Heath Hill is here representing the Oneida Nation of the Iroquois Confederacy. Scano. Ladies and gentlemen, we're about ready to go with our first grand entry here to kick things off for 2023 Gathering of Nations celebration on behalf of the Powell Committee, on behalf of GON faculty and staff. Yeah. Uh, we're going to call and welcome all of the visitors. We're going to welcome all the singers and dancers, spectators, those of you that are here for the first time. Welcome to Tingley Coliseum. Welcome to Gathering of Nations in Albuquerque. The Duke City. Put your Dukes up and put on some Daisy Dukes. I say. I say. <laughs> I'm just kidding. The only one allowed to wear Daisy Dukes is Bart Pawaki. Uh, 
Oh man, I'm glad Bart's here. I like to, uh, I like to recognize my brother Bart. He does full blood Daisy Dukes. I mean, he's so full blood, he's blue in the summertime. Z. But for real though, uh, you know, on behalf of Dennis, myself, and uh, uh, Joaquin, and Linda is up here as well. You might be looking at your neighbor, you might be looking around and waiting for, waiting for that U.S. Marine Corps veteran to walk in with that black leather vase, vest and that uh, Vietnam veteran hat on, and them jeans, and those, uh, he usually wear those New Balance, remember those, uh, those kind of uh, old man shoes, remember they're, they're them Nikes. One day I'm gonna get there. Every time I go shoe shopping, I see those blue Nikes. You know which one I'm talking about? They're the, the old grandpa dad shoes, right? My, my sons, they like to try to tease me. I'm going to wear those, uh, what the heck are they called again? Those blue and white, they're kind of wide Nikes. The dad shoes, right? Anyway, Vince wears those. Anyway, Vince is not going to be here this weekend. Vince is feeling ill. So, uh, so let's kind of keep Vince in our thoughts. Let's keep Brother Vince in our thoughts and our prayers, and uh, hopefully that he gets better and he'll be back on the trail this summer. On the count of three, let's say, hey, Vince, on the count of three. One, two, three, hey, Vince! Woo! All right. And then you gotta follow with the traditional Vince. Hi. Hi. You might find your mother-in-law a new choker. Hi. Are we ready to go? Speaking of mother-in-laws, Cricket, we ready to rock the house? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please stand and please rise as we bring in grand entry number one here, as we call upon our Eagle Staff Carrier by way of uh, Allen, South Dakota, by way of Pine Ridge, South Dakota of the uh, Teosh Bay, right? We're calling upon Thunder Valley's finest. Julius, not afraid to bring us in a grand entry. And speaking of Thunder Valley, we're going to kick it on over here to the Cheyenne Lakota Boy Alliance. Showtime, Hanovi, runs above. Nimanists, Teamo, Epo. We need sound. Randy, take my mic.
ladies and gentlemen, here on a grand entry as we welcome in. We invite dancers and champions from Indian country, US and Canada, as we welcome in all of our contestants of the Miss Indian World pageant. Welcome, ladies. Session, we welcome in leading our dancers, headband dancer from White Swan, Washington, Peter Joe Olney. And welcoming in from Swan Lake First Nation, Anishinaabe, Emily McKinney. Our Miss Indian World contestants making their way around the arena floor as we welcome in our Golden Age, our senior men's Southern Straight Dancers. We welcome in leading our champions, Mr. Rick Yazzie. Yate. Oh, Yate. And welcoming in all of our champion dancers and the newlywed, Kelly Grant. Shout out to Brother Tim, Kelly. We blah. We blah. Welcoming in our royalty, our princesses nationwide. We welcome in our golden age, our senior women dancers, and we welcome into the dance floor, leading our champions up, Boy Lab Senior. Good to see you, boy. here in the Tingley Coliseum as we welcome in champion dancers from Indian country. Welcome to the Gathering of Nations 2023. Wicha! Wicha! Four-pack Straight out of Montana, God's country. to the dance floor are men's traditional dancers, men's northern traditional, women's traditional. Welcoming in our women's jingle. Welcome, ladies, women's jingle. Randy, cricket, cricket. Walking Buffalo.
You're listening to the sounds of Canada's finest, one of Canada's finest drum groups, Walking Buffalo. Welcome to Albuquerque, boys. Welcome, dancers. Welcome, extraordinaire. All the Native Americans and Indians, indigenous, welcome to Grand Entry, all the champion dancers. Dance your style.
the circle. Let's have a big, big round of applause. Give it up. Give it up. Let's hear it. Indigenous and proud. Indigenous and powerful. Indigenous and beautiful. Ho ho! One more time, a big round of applause for Granite Tree number one right here in the Tingley. Uh, all right, tell them to hold up. Tell them to hold up. Is that the Thunder Boys? Save that song for later. Save me a piece of that corn for later. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to turn this time on over to Dennis, and he's going to introduce our invocation and our uh, gentleman that's going to be rendering that. Also, stand by. Showtime. Stand by, Novi. We'll be coming to you. Thank you, Group and Littlehead. We represent many beautiful traditional nations from our own home territories here on Turtle Island. Many of us in our teachings, our original instructions are when you gather the people, you begin with words of peace. And when we're finished, Tomorrow or Sunday morning about 3 o'clock, we again will finish this circle with words of peace, helping us with our message today, offering. We have our brother, Pat Pacheco. He's from Bernalillo, New Mexico. His nations are the Dakota Nation, the Santo Domingo Pueblo Nation, and he'll be helping us at this time. And Pat is a very respected person here as we walk on earth. He has helped many communities, many families, and so we want to thank Pat. So at this time, Pat Pacheco. Oh, mitake api, chate oste na chusa pelo. Toka kite hemie na yesiro mielo. Kuatsi opa. I welcome everyone here today. It's an honor to come before each and every one of you to say a prayer. Many of you travel many miles to get here. Even just getting here, we experience something wonderful, that cold weather. It makes us realize what we have and who we are. It's an honor to stand here after all these years, 
to stand here before each and every one of you, my people, to say a word of encouragement and prayer. My late father, Paul Pacheco Sr., was very instrumental in starting this powwow many years ago across the river, Albuquerque University. And Mr. Matthews, he really treats my family good, and we say wopida tonka for that. And I say thank you for all of you who have come here today. When we pray today, pray together, you look, look around, some of our relatives aren't here, they're gone. Look at your tables. Some of our relatives are gone also. So we dance. dance. Dance your best today. Sing your best today because we're not promised tomorrow. We're grateful. Grateful to wake up in the morning and say that prayer. To greet the sun. To watch Mother Moon go down. We're very blessed to breathe another breath of air today. Ho tu kashla kantaka tatai topa. Ho chi maka tu kashla kantaka tu kashla kantaka. Awayanka pi tu kashla kantaka. Mi oyate tu kashla kantaka. Tu kashla kantaka. Ho chi he mi oyate tu kashla kantaka. Tu kashla kantaka. Nazani. Nawozani to Kashakanta. Hey, me Oyate to Kashakantaka. To Kashakantaka, Awayanka be to Kashakantaka. A petty to Kile to Kashakantaka. To Kashakantaka. O check out Oloa, Namichi Ko to Kashakantaka. A petty. A pewe kola wa yelo hea hea A pewe eo kate ya ya Wo cheke hewa kawa Yuha oye wa yelo A pewe o maki ya yo a pewe kola wa yelo hai a hai a A pewe iyo kate ya ya Wo cheke wa kawa yuha oye wa yelo A pewe o maki ya yo hai Just be with us today, once again, as we dance, as we sing. Be with those, Creator, having a hard time today, those who need a blessing, those who need something. And I pray that my people here today get along, good words to one another, show kind respect and loving towards one another today, Creator. So, Creator, I thank you for 
another day of life, another breath of life for each and every one of us. Ohechi to Elo, mitak oyasu. Thank you, Pat. Thank you, Patrick Pacheco. Now, okay, so before we go to flag and victory, we're gonna turn the time on over to, we're gonna go ahead and uh, turn this time on over to Derek Matthews for our welcome address. Stand by showtime. Welcome to all of you. Welcome everybody here. Give me a little bit more volume on my mic, please, as the rappers say, pump it up. No. But anyway, I want to welcome everybody here. 40th anniversary. What did you think? 40 years. Did we ever think we'd be here this long? Give yourselves a big hand. You know, there are days when this is over, we are so tired. The first thing that happens is we laugh because our tiredness brings out laughter sometimes. And then we begin reminiscing over the moments we had here and planning for next time. You people, everybody here, all of us are so important. As we've heard so many times, those that are here were meant to be here. There were days in the last couple of weeks where things got tough really tough. There were days when we didn't know if we were ready to do this. Just yesterday, for example, was one of those days for me in particular. I didn't know what it would be like. I didn't even know if I'd be here with you today because of the way I was feeling inside. But to see you dancing, to see you shake your hands and give you a hug, give me a hug, give us a hug, it changed a lot. You healed us at this time to be ready to bring it forward. I want to thank you for that. And I want to take it one step further. Lita right here. Everybody knows Lita. 13 years ago, she had a liver transplant. She's still with us. And since then, she's celebrated it every year. But what was really important, it was the songs here it was the music, it was the people, it was the spirits, the prayers of our healer, our medicine man, Junior Albino, very critical. He was there. Everything went well. Our flag carrier today, our staff carrier right here, Julius Not Afraid, played a very big role in that because in 2010, we were out on the football field like a day like today, cold, freezing. And that Saturday night, Lito was waiting just two weeks from that transplant. And he blew a whistle on a drum. Showtime, I think it might have been. And he uh, wanted to give that song and blew that whistle for Lito's well-being. The next year, he was the head man dancer here. That, that bonnet he's wearing in that special he had, he presented the bonnet. He presented a buffalo robe, and he put that bonnet on that staff that he's carrying. And he told us that the spirits had, had told him to do this, and this was a chief's powwow. Chief's powwow. I don't know if, how many times you've seen that anywhere else. That's very important. And it's because of all of you, it's the spirit you bring here together. As Pat was saying, let's take care of each other. There's a lot happening these days that are out of our control, but together we can stand together. I want to one time again welcome all of you here, and while you're standing here, one of our state U.S. Congress people, Fernander, Fernandez Ledger, she's got a long name, Landers, Fernandez, Fernandez, whatever it is, you'll find out in a minute, because her video is going to roll as she's going to welcome you now. Here it is. Greetings. Teresa Welcome Ledger Fernandez. We have come to the state of New Mexico in the best powwow anywhere, whether it's your first gathering or your 15th. And no matter in which direction you come from, welcome. 
I'm Congresswoman and Teresa Leger Fernandez, serving the beautiful and beautifully diverse 3rd Congressional District of Nuevo Mexico. I serve 16 Pueblos, the Jicaria Apache Nation, and the Navajo Nation. I also was the former chairwoman and now the ranking member of the Subcommittee for Indigenous People, working for all of you, working to uplift, empower our communities, cultural strengths, and to reaffirm tribal sovereignty. It's an honor to welcome you all here today. The Gathering of Nations 2023. How's everybody feeling? Leaders among leaders, friends, family, relatives from our indigenous nations. As the first on these lands, even as you lost so much, you lead the way in traditional ecological knowledge. Your deep understanding of the lands, waters, and ecosystems around us will teach us how to build resilience for our forests, streams, and watersheds now threatened by the climate crisis. The last two years, we accomplished so much in Congress for tribal nations and Native Americans. We secured increased funding for the Indian Health Service and urban Indian organizations. We achieved historic investments in tribal infrastructure so that every home, no matter its zip code, can have both running water and high-speed internet so you can download the latest Young Spirit Singers drum song wherever you live. It's sad that we are barely talking now about bringing these basic necessities into Indian country but we will continue to make progress and we will get it done. I'm very proud of the fact that we provided $20 million for tribal languages in the American Rescue Plan. We know that language carries the songs and therefore the dance. And in those songs, it also carries historical and cultural knowledge. We lost so many elders to the virus. So we knew we had to strengthen language acquisition and maintenance. Finally, I want to talk about my Safeguard Tribal Objects of Patrimony Bill, the STOP Act, which was passed into law and signed by the President. That law protects your sacred items from being stolen and sold to the highest bidder in international auction houses. These sacred objects belong to the people and communities that know how to hold them sacred, that can truly oh. honor and revere their role in your culture. We are working with a great number of tribes as well on water rights because water oh. is the lifeline sustaining all traditions. It is essential to all of our ways of life. Our natural resources are irreplaceable and once lost, we will never recover them. Even as I speak right now, it's that time of year where water returns life to our communities. We must also acknowledge missing and murdered indigenous women and relatives. New Mexico's task forces, law enforcement, and our office are all working to make strides in mitigating this perversion. This injustice must come to an end, and we must all work together. These are a few of the accomplishments, but I want to actually raise something that's a little sad and scary. We need to, at this moment, be fighting against cuts to tribal education, health care, veteran services, climate resilience, and more. I can tell you that I am going to fight hard to make sure that the proposed cuts do not happen to those who most need the resources from the federal government. We have failed for too long to adequately fund the Indian Health Service, the Bureau of Indian Education, those things that are essential for striving and vibrant communities. I will continue to work for you, and I ask you to reach out to my office on issues that you consider important and you want us to champion in Congress. For our future, for our children, we will always fight. Prayers and blessings to you all. Let the drums singing good food and dancers war this gathering of nations. Thank you, Teresa Ledger Fernandez. Before we go into the flag and victory song, we have a very, very good friend who is from New Mexico, but is now in Washington, DC. And I understand that she is watching right now. I'm talking about Secretary of the Interior, Deb Hallen. Let's give her a big hand. 
like Teresa, she's got a lot of friends. She's doing a lot of work out there. She's protecting sacred lands and language and all the water that is so important. We need her there. We need the people there right now to do what they're doing. And you, all of us, when we get out of here, you can spread that word. Tell everybody where you are that we've got a good crew up there in Washington working for us right now. Let's keep them there as long as we can. And whoever comes after them, let's get after them. All right, let's move on back to Ruben. Here we go, Ruben Littlehead. Oh, thank you, Dennis. You know, ladies and gentlemen, uh, first and foremost, I want to thank all the dancers for being very reverent and respectful as we move along in the program here. Now we call upon our, our, one of our invited drums to render the appropriate songs for our Eagles staff and for all the dancers and the veterans. This afternoon time, I'm going to do something I haven't did in a long time as to sing with uh, our drum group to render out a flag song. This flag song comes to us by way of Busby, Montana of the White River people. Wupo Matano. Histo Hinnese Iso Mumma Towa. Now, the Showtime singers, they ally with the Lakota and the Cheyenne, some of the original members there, the Braveheart boys. Their mother comes from that community. And this song here that was taught to these boys and myself, uh, some of the late singers like the late Lee Lone Bear, the late Daniel Foote, the late Don Porkchop Shoulderblade, uh, the late Philip Whiteman Sr. Some of those prominent singers that have passed down songs, just as all these drum groups here render these songs have learned from their singers, from their fathers, uncles, grandfathers. So this afternoon time to kind of coincide with the prayers being said, Derek mentioned the, the bonnet that Julius gifted to the Gathering of Nations. Today, Julius wears it. He put it on and, and to dance with it, to kind of reignite, kind of reignite that spirit and feeling again. So thank you for doing that, Julius. Wopila, Tonka. So this afternoon, if you're physically able, please stand and rise as this song is for our Eagle staff, our colors, our veterans, our warriors, men and women. Yeah. So I say, histo all he nay, histo all he nay, heme who dano, hey, ah, hi, ho, hey, hey, hey. Let's hear your bell. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, as this song is rendered here, let us remember our warriors, past, present, future. Our flag song here, rendered by Showtime, coming to us from the Bernie District, Ovalman Hun. Bernie flag song. Hey-ha! Hey-ha! And 
now to remember the alliance of singers of past. Once upon a time in 1876, some tribes gathered together and took down the 7th Calvary and captured that American flag. Let it be known, this song here, the Lakota flag song, combined with the Cheyenne flag song together. Hey, 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 watch that law. Thank you, Showtime. Nia Ishmen Le Wopi Latanka. Thank you. And now we're going to come back to Showtime for our victory song. Anytime you're ready, Nova, we're going to kick it back to our, our invited drum. Showtime singers, whenever you're ready, here we go. We're going to dance in victory in Tingley Coliseum, Indian style. Let's dance in victory! Another big round of applause. Ladies and gentlemen, let's put our hands together. Grand entry. And now at this time, dancers on the floor, we're gonna look to the person to your left, shake their hand and give them an ah. Look to the person to your right, shake their hand and give them an ah. 
and you are excused. Dancers, drink some water. Those of you in the crowd, you may be seated. Come studs. And we're gonna uh, bring Julius, Missenden World, Peter, Joe, and Emily, stand by. We're gonna bring you in here momentarily. In the meantime, and in between time, we're gonna get things ready to go as we got Randy Medicine Bear, George Cricket Shields, as we move along to some introductions. Once again, we remind each and every one of you to drink some water, stay hydrated. We are about 6,000 elevation. It gets kind of hot in here. And also, we want to uh, welcome and wish good luck to all the Miss Indian World contestants. Ladies, good luck. Yeah. Miss Indian World is exiting to stage 49. Ladies and gentlemen, bring in our Eagle staff this afternoon. How about a big round of applause for Julius Not Afraid? Julius. Serving as our head band dancer this afternoon's session, coming to us from Yakima Nation, Mr. Peter Joel Olney. Representing the Swan Lake First Nation of the Anishinaabe, Emily McKinney. All right, we're gonna turn the microphone on over at Young Spirit. Jake, I'm gonna ask you for two starts to dance in our head man and our head lady, respectively, this afternoon. I haven't seen Peter Joe dance in over a year. Young Spirit, whenever you're ready, Jake, we got a microphone on over there. Two stars, Jake, Nigamook. One more time, let's give these two champion dancers a round of applause. Come on up, Peter Joe. Come on up, Emily. Before we go to some introductions and the cordless mic, we have a cordless mic out there somewhere. James is looking for it. But uh, they're not going to, uh, I think they're not going to give you your mic back, James. So. I guess you could take the rest of the afternoon off. Ah, Bart knows my style. I believe we're gonna go with two the tribals before we get into some, uh, to some uh, contest dancing here. We wanna introduce real quickly some of our head staff helping us out this weekend. We're gonna ask you to come on out to the dance floor and wave to the people. Introducing from Tuba City by way of Salamanca, New York, Dennis Bowen. Mount Pleasant, Michigan, Jason Whitehouse. From Tama, Iowa, Larry Ozzy. From Shawnee, Oklahoma, Joaquin Hamilton. From Santa Fe, New Mexico, James Edwards. Our head Northern Dance Judge, Vernon Street. Our head Southern Dance Judge, Sophia Thurman. Our head Northern Judge, Lonnie Street. 
And our head Southern Drum Judge, Jay Mill. We got Otter Trail for Gord Dance. We got Randy and Cricket. And our invited drums, Showtime, Blazing Bear, Kozad, Young Spirit, Ho Chunk Nation, and District 6 Elk Creek. Two inner tribals, one from Blazing Bear and one from Young Spirit. And then we're going to get into it. So, Blazing Bear, whenever you're ready. Junior girls, fancy, you're going to be up first. Head man, head lady. Blazing Bear, are we ready to rock and roll? John David Ballard, JDB. Drum judges, get ready. Women back up. Judges, get ready. Hey, everybody dance, come on out. Here we go. Oh, oh. 40th Annual Gathering of Nations. Come on out. Judges, come and get your seat. Northern Southern Drum Judges, we've got your seats right over here. Come on up, Harry, Harry.
Mal Winkel. Thank you, Blazing Bear. Thank you, gentlemen. Glad you're here. Glad you made it. Before we go to Young Spirit, we're going to introduce and call upon some judges to come on down and check in with Sophia and Verna. Also, after Young Spirit sings, we're going to be going to a smoke dance exhibition as we have some smoke dancers in the house. We need Alexa Ray Day, Michigan, Shannon Gustafson, Ontario. Hey, Shannon. I've been patiently waiting over here looking for Shannon Gustafson. I heard she has something for me. Doug Schofield from California, not Kansas no more. Nathan Largo, New Mexico. John O'Brady, Miss OU, Indigenous something. Oh, and then uh, Franda Flying Man, Flying Man Lemonade. Franda, that's uh, Daryl's shout out right there for a lemonade for me. Denise One Star from Two Strikes Out Dakota. Roberta Smith from Flagstaff, Doko Hasleed. Morning Star Roberts, all the way from Oklahoma, and Eikerson Hopper from New York. Joaquin? We also need these Southern singing judges to come on up here and check in with uh, Brother Jay Mule. We need Xavier Tohe from Oklahoma, Pat Pacheco, Carnegie, Oklahoma, Minnesota, Dale Roberts, Atwood, Oklahoma, Matt Sheikah Sr., Winter Rock, Arizona, Jacinia Valles, Browning, Montana, Boy Lad, Albuquerque, New Mexico, Donovan Abbey, Mandarin, North Dakota, and stand by uh, Nicole Nordwall and uh, Jesse Silks. We also need these uh, women's backup judges as well. We need Adriana Douglas. Mohawk, Six Nations, April Draper, Navajo, Kirtland, New Mexico, Darlena King, Utah, Navajo. We also need uh, Desiree Nimon, Cree Nation. We also need Precious Paul, Post Creek, Montana. So we need those judges to come on up here and check in with our head judges. Back to you, Ruben. <clears throat> right on. Real quickly, we also need Joseph Newman. AZ, Joseph with the, with the awesome fingers to make creative, beautiful beadwork earrings. Regis Cook, Douglas Schofield again. Douglas, you're gonna have to clone yourself. We need you twice. Gordon Smith, Heath Brown, Clifford Monroe. Bino Garcia's in the house. Bino, where's my boots? Alicia Star Peters and Jeremy Kidd. Also, right after the uh, Young Spirit Smoke Dance, and then we're going to start the contest with the Junior Girls Fancy. Blazing Bear, you'll have that song. And then Showtime, you'll be second on the contest singing. We're going to start the singing contest as well for Lonnie Street. Real quick here, guys, just want to thank on behalf of Gathering Your Nations, all of our major sponsors, Ultra Health, this year's title sponsor, the Albuquerque City Council, Health and Human Services, State of New Mexico, Wells Fargo, Chicken Ranch Casino, Illuminative, presenting American Genocide, American Airlines, the County of Bernalillo and their DWI Prevention Program, the Honeywell Corporation and the Department of Energy's National Security Campus visit Albuquerque, Paula Casino, Spa and Resorts, the National Highway Transportation Safety Administration, Malloy Nissan dealerships right here in New Mexico, the United States Coast Guard, the FBI's Missing and Murdered Indigenous Peoples Program, 
Tikal Time Music RV and Resort, the Shoshone Bannock Tribes Agricultural Resource Project. Once again, Gathering a Nation thanks each and every one of you. Back to you, Ruben. Oh, thank you, James. Once again, we need those singing judges that were called upon. Come down here and check it with Lonnie. We need those dance judges coming down here. Check it with Vernon and Sophia and Jay Mill too as well. And also we need these judges as well. Real quickly, Darlene Pacheco, Nathan Littlecrow, Tanya Shanta, Elva, Elvira. Oh, Elvin, Elvin Nicotine. Sorry, Elva, Elvin. <laughs> Vanessa Concho, Heath Hill, Kenneth Taylor and Catherine Sage. And Matthew Duncan. All right, let's kick it on over to Young Spirit. They've been waiting to rock the house. Here we go, Jacob Faithful. Young Spirit! Yeah. Cricket. Thank you, young spirit. Hi, hi. H I Y H I Y. Hi, hi. Dancers, let's clear the arena floor. We need Randy Medicine Bear or Cricket Shields, our arena director up here in front of the announcer stand, please. We need our smoke dancers to be standing by. And our
Once again, as we start the uh, singing contest, the dance contest, Blazing Bear, you'll have uh, song number one for the Junior Girls Fancy, I do believe. And then we kick it on over here to Showtime for the second group. And I want to thank Shannon Gustafson for bringing my goodies down. Chi McGwitch. Randy, are we going to exhibition the Golden Age and adults or just cut them loose? Exhibition? Okay. Adults, Golden Age, and elders be standing by. We're going to exhibition you right after the smoke dancers. Are they taking points? Yes, they are. <laughs> Just kidding, I don't know. Not sure. Where's your judges, Jay? Did you get your judges? Jacenia Velez. Also, who do you need, Lonnie Heath? You got him? Gordy Smith from Manitoba. And Joseph Newman. I need some beaded earrings. Smoke dancers, come on in. And let's get that cordless mic down to the bottom of the floor. Regis, are you ready to go? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna turn this microphone on over to Dennis Bowen, and he's gonna talk a little bit about uh, this style of dance that comes from his country up there in uh, upstate New York. And Dennis, if you would, take us through the Smoke Dance Exhibition. Dennis Bowen, Sr. All right, we're getting the mic stand, get this all set up. Regis Koch is one of our singers from our communities up there in Haudenosaunee territory. And so he'll be calling all Smoke Dancers we will use your number that you have, and that will be the number the judges will be watching. So smoke dancers, Gaji, come on out, all smoke dancers. The smoke dance, it's, it kind of has a long, long history. A part of the smoke dance derives from the old war dance of our people. And through time, a lot of our younger ones wanted to dance faster, and so our singers took care of this, and they've added to the smoke dance. They've added many songs. And so Regis Cook is one of the singers that is asked many times to sing for smoke dancing. So you're gonna see them tell a story, they're gonna do this, this dance, and Regis Hill decide which way he's going to sing. He could sing old war dance first. He could sing smoke dance. He could sing what we call half and half. Half old war dance and half smoke dance. So he'll be talking for each, each of these songs. All right, so we're How many smoke dance fans we got here? All right, all right, all right. And we're gonna have some smoke dancing tomorrow. Tomorrow. Check, check, Amos check. Yazi, he smoke danced about eight years ago. Where are you, Amos? Check, 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 check. Okay. We represent many nations for the smoke dancers. We've got check, check. from the Eastern Edge, we have the Mohawk Nation. Then the Oneida Nation, Onondaga Nation, right there, Cayuga Nation, Seneca Nation, Tuscarora Nation. All right, all right. So you're going to enjoy this. Okay, judges are ready. Okay, Regis, introduce yourself. Say hello and. We are so glad you're here. This is for exhibition. All right, so we're going to be demonstrating the smoke dance. And uh, Heath Hill has asked for the women to come out and demonstrate their style first. So all the men step off. 
All our ladies, come on the floor. We're going to demonstrate the fast style smoke dance. Here we go, ladies. Let's hear it. Round of applause. These are the women. All right, so at this time, we're going to ask the men to come out on the floor and demonstrate. Uh, we're going to give them the old style war dance, and we're going to show you the, where this dance originate, originated from, which we call the war dance. And then after that, we'll give them a fast one and show you how it evolved. Here we go men's war dance. Make them like it, boys. We have a we have a In the Shone, we are about over 2,200 to 2,900 miles away. So they've traveled long ways to be with us. Here we go, next song. So at this time, they'll go nowhere, guys. See, they're all out of breath. But uh, we're going to bring them out for one more. And uh, we're going to open it up. Anyone that wants to come out, everyone, this one's for everyone. Come out and join in on a one big smoke dance. Here we go. Drum group, send out your best smoke dancer. Zix. Yeah. All right. Drum groups, come and smoke dance. Spectators, come and smoke dance. Bart Pawaki, come and smoke dance. Not Bart. Just kidding, Bart. Go ahead. Get it, Bart. Get it. Round of applause. This is our exhibition. Tonight will be the first contest for smoke dancing. Tonight. And then the second round smoke dance contest tomorrow night. But this was just the exhibition. 
All right, Ruben, we got to get some judges up here. Yes, sir. Let's get some dance judges up here. Sophia, do you have all your judges? Uh, Jay Mew, do you have all your judges? Lonnie Street, do you have all your judges? And uh, who's our other one? And uh, no, uh, Verna. Verna should have all of her judges. Sophia. Rita Gilman, okay, we're only gonna announce your judges one time, and after that, you gotta go out there and call them, text them, or whatever. But we're also gonna give a quick shout out. Cheryl Croce, Calgary Stampede, Kyle and Shannon, welcome to Gathering of Nations, welcome to Albuquerque. Wanna welcome Julie LeBrake, Tony LeBrake, representing Sequan Kumiai. Welcome. Also, Florida Seminole Wanda Bowers. I don't know where you are, but I'm giving you a shout out as well. And, uh, Gino Osceola. And also, if you like that Seneca, that that uh, that uh, smoke dancing, come on up to Salamanca Power, July 14, 15, and 16. I believe the third weekend in July, we'll be up there rocking the house. All right, we ready to go, Cricket? Let's bring him in. The first contest this afternoon, I believe we got the Junior Girls Fancy. We need the singing judges to Blazing Bear. Dance judges, we need you to stick close by. Junior Boys Fancy. Showtime. Junior Boys Grass, Young Spirit. And then we're gonna go on down the line, stand by Fort Peck Sioux, Walking Buffalo, Indian Hill. Also, we're getting a Southern song this afternoon, dancers, and this goes out to the parents, actually because usually the parents come all the way to Albuquerque and their little girls dancing fancy, but they're dancing to a Southern song, but that's all right. Blazing Bear can rock the house. Tomorrow, you may get a second song. Now, this is going off one group. If Randy or Cricket says we need two groups, then we're gonna switch up the songs there, Showtime, stand by. Cricket, what are we doing? One group, one song, I like your style. Also, real quickly, heads up to everybody in Tingley Coliseum, those of you that came to Albuquerque for a good time, you came looking for Mr. Wright or Mrs. Wright, it's Friday afternoon, it's early. Snag now. Tonight, you get a second chance. Tomorrow's the leftovers. And if you happen to go to the UNM Power on Sunday over there on campus, those are the might as well. Might as well. <laughs> Man, I haven't said that one in a long time. Are we ready to go? Are we ready to go? There's the sign, Blazing Bear. Blaze it up, boys. Blaze it up.
Having a big round of applause. Ladies and gentlemen, the JGF kicking us off in contest. All right, girls, follow the leadership of Randy and Cricket down the sideline there. Court side. Yeah. Man. Speaking of court side, how about those LA Lakers, huh? Yeah. Poke the bear. Poke the bear. Any Bear Clan people here? Bear Clan, let's hear it. All right. My clan is the Bear Clan too, so when uh, you see the Lakers play, they're trying to poke the bear on the Lakers. Yeah. Junior boys fancy you should be out there, and as soon as we get the word, Lonnie, let me know you got your judges. All right, Lonnie, Kansas City Chiefs, baby. World champs. I need uh, Vernon Street, let me know you got all your judges. Jay Mills, Sophia Thurman, let me know you got your judges. Junior boys fancy, are you guys ready to go? Who's got the fastest pair of size five moccasins out there on the floor? Let's go, Leo. Somebody said, who has the fastest pair of size six moccasins? And somebody said, Randy Medicine Bear. <laughs> Just kidding, Randy. Just keep. Oh, go ahead, who is that? Is that you, Jason? Is that you, Larry? Southern Drum Judges. We need you to report to the uh, next Southern Drum. Southern Slam. All right, stand by, showtime. Are we ready to go? Here we go, showtime, S-H-O-W-T-I-M-E. Put your hands together, make some noise for the junior boys. Man, that's what you call some world-class singing showtime. In the words of a wise Lakota elder, they say, Lila Washtelo. In the words of an old wise Cheyenne elder, they say, Esh Peva. Ah. Yeah. Let's move on the contest category. Where are we at, Dennis? Junior Boys Grass. Come on into the arena. Who's singing, Linda? Young Spirit, that's right. Young Spirit, it's good to see you, Jake. You know, uh, Jake and I, we're uh, Facebook friends, and uh, we follow each other on Facebook, and uh, every time a new post comes up, Jake Faithful is printing some new gear for Boohorn, 
for Young Spirit. And then uh, Jake and I, we're supposed to collaborate too on some uh, Little Head shirts too. So that's in the making, Jake. Yeah. Junior Boys Grass, let's come on out. They're ready to go. Judges are ready. One group, one song. Young Spirit Sinkers Contest. Here we go. Junior Boys Grass Dance. Let's give these grandsons a big round of applause. Cheer them on, grandsons. Okay, grandsons, come line up. Come line up. Okay, we need some safety pins. We need safety pins here at the MC stand. Anyone have some safety pins? Bring them up. Help us out. Now we go to... Junior Girls Jingle Dress. Junior Girls Jingle, granddaughters step into the circle. Fort Pak Su drum group will have the contest song. So Junior Girls Jingle, second call, come into the circle. Junior Girls Jingle, hooray, hooray. Also earlier, uh, we were gonna announce and uh, exhibition the adults, Golden Age and Elders, but uh, we are just going to excuse you for the afternoon. So adults, elders, and golden age, you are excused. The casino is 35 minutes away. Real quick here, guys, just want to remind everybody about the Gathering of Nations official merchandise booths out there on the food court, out here on the south side of Tingley, and on the west side of Tingley in the concourse. All of your official CDs, T-shirts, hoodies, everything you can think of, from past Gathering of Nations and current Gathering of Nations are available there. A mighty good shopping at the Trader's Market as well, right across the way, northwest corner of the Tingley. Back to you guys. One song, 
Okay, one song, one group. Here we go. Junior Girls Jingle Contest, Fort Pack Sioux. Give them a beautiful song. Jingle dress. The healing dress, the healing dance. <laughs> Junior girls traditional, northern and southern combined, get ready. Junior girls traditional, get ready. Let's cheer these granddaughters. Cheer the granddaughters on, let's hear it. Applause, junior girls, jingle dress. Okay, granddaughters, check your numbers, come line up. Thank you, thank you, Fort Peck Sioux. Now we go to the next contest, junior girls, traditional. This is junior girls, northern, and then after that, junior girls, southern, get ready. Got it circle. So we're gonna go with the girls first? No, see, see, girls and then girls. So yeah. Okay. Alicia Star Peters, come on up, help us. Alicia Star Peters. Huckle and Janu. Lani. Okay, junior girls, traditional. Northern are getting ready to go. Okay, Northern and Southern combine. Real quick. Southern, come, you are all out here also. Junior girls, combine Northern and Southern. Junior girls, combine Southern and Northern, combine. We don't want to lose anyone. So mothers, aunties, get your little girl out here. And we're gonna go to the Walking Buffalo Singers for the contest song. And granddaughters, Today, you'll get a northern song. Tomorrow, you get a southern song. So, Walking Buffalo is ready to go. We're checking our judges, our dancers. There's the signal. Contest, Walking Buffalo Singers.
Junior Boys Traditional, Southern Northern Combined, get ready. Junior Boys Traditional, get ready. Indian Hill, you have the song. Let's give these granddaughters a big round of applause. Encourage them, encourage them. Round of applause one more time. Thank you, walk-in Buffalo singers. Okay, junior girls, come line up, make some room for each other. And junior girls, you look wonderful in your dresses, your family, your neighbors, your helpers that made your dresses for you, and all the beadwork, very beautiful, beautiful. Okay, now we go to junior boys traditional. You'll get a northern song today, a southern song tomorrow. Then we want to have Teen Young Women's Fancy Shawl get ready. Teen Young Women's Fancy Shawl get ready. And the drum, the drum for this group, Junior Boys Traditional, is Indian Hill. Indian Hill, get ready. And then the song for Teen Young Women's Fancy Shawl will be Thunder Boys. Thunder Boys will sing fast and fancy. Dennis. Yes. Let me break in real quick, remind everybody to go on out and check out all of our vendors. Right now, you head on off to the north side, Arts and Craft Building. All right there, everyone knows them vans. They got them new vans, Pendleton shoes in. They also have Rob Vargas, he'll be a world-renowned painter. He's going to be out there painting once again. And they also have Tony Elva. He'll be signing autographs. So head on over there. Check out all of our vendors. All right, back to you, Dennis. Thank you. All right. One song, one group, and here we go. Contest, Indian Hill.
round of applause. Thank you, thank you. Indian Hill Singers, good, good song. Grandsons, check your numbers, line up. Make some room for each other and come on over. Check your numbers. Good one. Real quickly, uh, Dennis, real quick. You see that little young dancer right there in a the wheelchair coming on out? That is Keaton Constant, ladies and gentlemen, all the way from Saskatchewan. And, and he was jamming out down here on the floor, man. Did yeah. you see him? I like it. Welcome to Gathering of Nations, Keaton. At the Choctaw Cultural Center, learn about the past while becoming wiser for the future. Explore authentic Choctaw dwellings, interact with village demonstrators, and enjoy authentic traditional Choctaw meals at the Champlain Cafe. We invite you to join us for a memorable journey through the past, present, and future at the Choctaw Cultural Center in Durant, Oklahoma. A living, breathing experience. boys you'll have we're gonna have two groups no one group two songs thunder boys first song sharp shooter second song so thunder boys first song for teen young women's fancy shawl now these are a lot of dancers to have our judges watch for one song so they're gonna do the best they can and these beautiful granddaughters, some of them travel a long, long ways to be with us. And some of them are from this area, from the region. And so we're so happy, our beautiful young ladies, these granddaughters are gonna show you how it's done, fast and fancy. So Thunder Boys is one group, two songs, Thunder Boy Contest. Round of applause, song number one. Okay, granddaughters, catch your breath, walk around. Your second song is coming up by the Sharpshooter Singers. All right. And these granddaughters, thank you. You look so beautiful, these shawls. 
These shawls are indigenous fine art. They are works of art, the beautiful patterns, designs. I just want to give a quick shout out to a real good brother. His name's Dr. Vincent Yellow Old Woman. And Vincent Yellow Old Woman, former chief up at Sixka. Sixka, he is here with his family, sitting over by the uh, post number W. So good to see you, Vincent. We'll visit later. We also want to acknowledge from the Choctaw Nation Council, Angela Hudley. Angela Hudley from the Choctaw Nation Council from Mississippi. Welcome. And Edna Williams just got done with her knee surgery. A lot of us, she's a good sister. A lot of us who are now in our senior years, we're getting help, getting knee surgery. So let's help each other. And we really are happy that we get old, we can't dance like we used to. At the Choctaw Cultural Center, learn about the past while becoming wiser for the future. Explore authentic Choctaw dwellings, interact with village demonstrators, and enjoy authentic traditional Choctaw meals at the Champlain Cafe. We invite you to join us for a memorable journey through the past, present, and future at the Choctaw Cultural Center in Durant, Oklahoma, a living, breathing experience. For hours, events, and tickets, please visit ChoctawCulturalCenter.com. The Choctaw Cultural Center may be the closest you'll ever come to taking a walk through time, gaze upon ancient cultural artifacts, witness the evolution of tribal technology, and immerse yourself. Support these granddaughters. Another round of applause for the granddaughters. Keen Young Women's Fancy Show. applause okay granddaughters come over here make some room for each other this is going to be a long line and it's a pretty good challenge for the judges there we go to our next contest the Choctaw Cultural Center may be the closest you'll ever come to taking a walk through time gaze upon ancient cultural artifacts witness the evolution of tribal technology and immerse yourself in a Choctaw culture through interactive experiences. Journey with us through the past, present, and future. The Choctaw Cultural Center in Durant, Oklahoma, a living, breathing experience. For hours, events, and tickets, visit ChoctawCulturalCenter.com. This event, and we're really happy to be a part of it. So Wells Fargo has been working with the Native communities for almost 70 years and uh, we are a leading provider of capital and financial services to tribes and tribal-owned enterprises. We also um, offer product services and financial education programs tailored to help tribal clients, tribal governments, and tribal enterprises. And we 
hope to have them succeed financially. So Wells Fargo maintains banking relationships with one out of three federally recognized Native Americans and Alas Alas Alaska Native tribes in the U.S. So we've also been doing business with more than 300 Native Americans and Alaska Native tribal entities in 25 states. So we are also proud to say that 54 branches are in or within close proximity to tribal lands. And they have their booth, which is right over in the Arts and Crafts building. Go right down the middle lane and you will find them. I believe you have some giveaway stuff. Yes, we are at booth 89, so uh, feel free to come by and spin our wheel to win a prize. There you go, Banks giving away stuff. Head on over, slot 89 over at the Arts and Crafts building. Back to you, Dennis. Thank you, Jason Whitehouse. He's one of the MCs, a roving reporter. Here we go, one song, one group. Iron Star Singers will do the honors, and our grandsons are ready to go now. How many Fancy Dance fans we got here? Let's hear it. Fancy Dance fans, scream, holler, whistle. Make some noise now. These young men, they're going to show you how it's done. Contest Iron Star. Southern judges go to Southern Slam. Round of applause. Teen Young Men's Fancy Dance. Come line up. Thank you, Iron Star Singers. All right, Ruben, Brother Ruben. Thank you, Dennis. Also, I just want to give a quick shout out here. This afternoon, there's going to be a young... To the daydreamers, explorers. Go-getters. Visionaries. Let there be no limit to how you see yourself or where. American Airlines, you are why we fly. And singing for you, we have Iron Bear, are you there? 
I believe Iron Bear and Southern Slam. Is that right? Oh, okay. So we need Iron Bear, and there may be two groups. So Iron Bear, stand by, and War Thunder. Yeah. Real quick here, guys, just want to break in and remind you to go on over to the official Gathering of Nations merchandise booths. Go on out there to the powwow grounds. Check out what's going on. We've got roving and uh, traditional performances going on. We've got Stage 49 with all kinds of indigenous musical acts. We have uh, the Traders Market going over here on the north side side. And we want to give a good shout out for Ruben. He has his official t-shirts and hoodies. You guys come on up here and see Ruben. He's got his t-shirts and hoodies this year for sale. Thank you, James. Actually, they're out there in the uh, vendor area with uh, Three Feathers, uh, Star Quilts. Uh, come and check him out as well, Ben Leadham. And then he has shirts and hoodies. And then I also got some stickers too, James. Some retro stickers. Looks like one group, two songs. Are we doing both straight? Because of the singing contest, right? Okay. All right. So first song, Iron Bear. Second song, War Thunder. Cricket said it's up to the singers because it is singing contest. So it's up to you, War Thunder. All right, here we go. Teen Girls Jingle. Let's rock the house. Iron Bear. B-E-A-R. Not B-A-R-E.
How about that, ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for these teen girls jingle. Song number one, move around. You got a second song coming to you. And then uh, quick shout out up there to um, Wind River Reservation in Wyoming, Carrie and Gene Yellow Bear watching live. Also Arnold Mountain Horse. And uh, I spoke about Calgary Stampede earlier and uh, Arnold Mountain Horse is a world champion, um, what do you call it? Chuck wagon, yeah, they raced those. In 2020, there were 613 alcohol-involved crashes in Bernalillo County. Nearly 20% were fatal. Don't put tomorrow's memories at risk. The land of manana isn't the same without you. Be here tomorrow. Don't drink and drive. Kidding, Verna. Yeah, where's my Oklahoma guy when I need it? Yeah, there it is. Yeah. Oh, that's where you met. Oh, that's right. That's where they met. Yeah. The truth is coming out. The truth shall set you free. Here we go, song number two, War Thunder. Bring the thunder from down under. Let's put our hands together for the teen girls jingle. We're gonna line you up down the sideline. And real quickly, I wanna give another shout out for Dr. Lita Matthews jingle dress special happening this afternoon. Hit, and then the next year, rest in peace, Uncle Donnie, Donnie, and then. But now he's here. He's in good spirits, and uh, man, does he look ever sexy. 
Good to see you, brother. Thank you, Reuben. You know, it's a great honor to be here this weekend to serve along some of the best MCs in Indian country. But yeah, uh, at this time, we'd like to have these judges stand by for the um, Dr. Lita Matthews Jingle Special. We need Josie Little Sky, Sheena Kane, Carol Mountingtello, Alexa Ray Day, and Lisa Meacher. Stand by and be ready. All right, grass dancers, come on into the arena. Stand by, Colin Eagle. Get us a good tune lined up as soon as we get situated out here on the arena. We're waiting for the high sign from the ADs. How you doing out there, Albuquerque, New Mexico? Hey. Yeah, it's good to be here. How are we looking there, Cricket? All right, you said one moment. One group, two songs. Stand by, Colin Eagle. You're going to get the first song. Okay, so call an eagle, you'll get the first song, and Showtime, you'll get the, uh, the second song. Look up here, ladies, we have a, a hair breadth that was turned in. Ladies, check your braid, check your otter. Come on up here. Jeez, they're falling apart out there. There's a white scarf up here, too. We almost have enough for a full outfit. Hey. All right, fellas, you're going to get two songs. We got the high sign. We're coming over here to Colin Eagle. It's time to rock the house. Here we go. How about that, ladies and gentlemen? Let them hear it. Woo, man. That's what we call some top-notch dancing and some phenomenal singing. Good job there. Colin Eagle. Stand by showtime. Get us a real good jam lined up.
Today, let's continue the celebration by protecting ourselves and our loved ones with an updated vaccine that protects against both the original COVID virus and Omicron. For Billy and Grandma, Komachi, aho! Pine Ridge Reservation, a former Catholic Indian boarding school, is preparing to search its grounds for the mass graves of former students. But one investigator and one activist find something much deeper. American Genocide from Illuminative. Subscribe. You're up next. So get them on, get ready, get your shawl ready. We got the high sign. We're coming over here to showtime. Take it away. Foot slide. <laughs> How about that, ladies and gentlemen? Line it up, fellas, line it up. That's what we're talking about. Man, oh man, what a song. Team Yad Eche, Officer Montez de Shijine, Nanesh Ejitkachi Ninshno, Kiani E. Bushishin, Ashi Hitashanale, Hanagati E. Dashiche, B. Yotobet Hahozo, Salao E, the eight Daljinigi, Aji Eka, Salao E, Shananishish, but our E. A son in Shin, B. Nahaka Pik E. It's not a ak a di kahigi nadin nadin ka gathering of nations di kaya asaan de beti ishkiji don da ko anihi de ne da ne de ne at ospeda ajish pan al da peldil senede e benache e han eshli tole di salao da ne de ne pan da nihi kako aden se do ya asho de ye go da da kosiya. Nihichide do Nihinalie, Doni Hichida Aad, Ado Aad, that our Danosin, Ado Danja, a so person that has a Ad Esto, a da da Hosia, Ado Basel business, Nihinalie, Chidib, Aishan beat Nasnele, a hot ani, a nika, Bakotanosin, Ado a chin, a tag your tat, that source. Eliago, let's in Baalti, a be a hosen, a chene yo el would go, let's in Benache, Jehodone, Cote Hudetni, Ado Ado a cake de Jonago, Danichidonato, Ada da Hosia, Ado Nikis allow the need lini, a so need it that they need eat or she had. Green chili with my bologna sandwich. Then I had green chili with my wujape. Oh, jeez, that's real tradition. Threw it on that wujap. <laughs> I threw my green chili on my wheat chicks. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to put green chili on her neck. 
Got that straw ready. <laughs> Vehicle crashes are a leading cause of death for children under 13. Honor your tribal heritage by keeping your children safe. Use the right car seat, booster seat, or seat belt for your child every time. All right, we got. All right, we got the high side. We're coming over here to Young Spirit. Take it away. Stand by Teen Girl Southern Traditional Southern Slam. How about that, ladies and gentlemen? What a wonderful combination of song and dance. Thank you, thank you. All right, we need these judges to come on up this way. We need Josie Little Sky. She horse parade here. We're inviting everybody to come on out. And also, Tashina Redhawk is inviting all the horse dance, tail dance participants to come on out. You're going to be assisting with the horse parade. So all the dancers that are taking part of the horse tail dance, you're welcome to come on out and take part of the horse parade at 4 o'clock. Back to you, Joaquin. All right, I just got word that we're going to go ahead and finish this last teen girls category and then we're going to get into Dr. Lita's jingle special and then we're going to come back to the teen boys categories. All righty. How are we looking out there, Cricket? We got one group and one song. Are we ready to go? We got the high sign. We're coming over here to Southern Slam. Let's swing and sway the Albuquerque way. Hey, wick. 
Shaw, here we go. Take it away. Teen Boy Southern Straight will come to you right after the Jingle Dress Special. Women's Jingle, 15 to 30. Stand by, you're coming up next. Big round of applause for the Teen Girls, Southern Traditional. Thank you, Southern Slam from Heyman. Or New Mexico is the fifth largest state, and we've got maybe a little over two million people around here. That equals a lot of open land. It's not that hard to find a quiet spot and a place where you can't see another person. I kind of enjoy those types of times. Back to the teen categories, but. Uh, on the program, it does say 2.30, so I guess they're sticking by the category. Is that right, James? Uh, I believe so. All right. If anybody has any questions, uh, come on over here and, and uh, let it be known to James Edwards. Uh, remember when they have those slapping contests and they, yeah. James and Joaquin are going to slap each other. Just slap each other. For over 60 years, we've been honored to support the enduring spirit of Native communities. The same spirit that inspired a local housing authority to jumpstart the revitalization of an entire neighborhood. It guided a community to build a future for themselves by teaching others about their home. And it led a scholarship program to develop its own academic support services for students. 
Wells Fargo has committed $50 million over five years to support the enduring spirit of Native communities in this moment and for generations to come. At this time, uh, we'd like to call in the women jingle dress dancers ages 15 to 30. We're going to get into this uh, special competition at this time. We'd also like to ask our teen boys to stand by. We're going to be coming right back at you as soon as we finish here with this special. Real quickly, Joaquin, that's going to be the Teen Boys Southern Straight. I believe that's rendered by Blazing Bear. Is that right, Linda? Teen Boys Northern Traditional. And then uh, those are the final two categories. Is that right? Okay. Fort Peck Sioux. All right. Back to you, Joaquin. At this time, uh, I'd like to turn the microphone over here to uh, Derek Matthews. He's going to uh, share a few words with us. Hi. Oh, hey. Okay, at this time we're going to go into this special. Every year for the last several, maybe over a decade, at least since we've been in this place, this arena here, Dr. Lita, Lita here, has always had the special honoring the women, either the applique dress or the jingle or stationary. She chose the jingle this year, 15 to 31 years old. I'm going to call Lita out, and I'd like for the, uh, the donor association to meet her in the arena at this time. And I'm going to give, uh, let me see, let me use a, hi, hi. You can go on with them and introduce them. So Joaquin's going to go out there and uh, intro this group. In 2010, I mentioned it earlier, Lita had a liver transplant, a living donor from Santa Clara Pueblo and everything was so successful that she owes and is paying back every year to honor those that are donors and those that are recipients. It's a good thing. So many people run into these problems it's of needing these organs and the Organ Donor Association Donate Life, a national organization comes here every year to honor those in this area, New Mexico and Arizona. So I'm going to turn it over to Joaquin. You can go through the intros, and we'll get ready for this contest. Ladies and, Ladies and gentlemen, uh, we have some special guests here. And it's my honor to introduce you to Selena. She is uh, in charge of the uh, Donate Life New Mexico. So she's going to introduce the organization here at this time. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody, for allowing us this time. Thank you, Dr. Matthews and the whole Matthews family. We're truly indebted. It's not news to us that Native Americans suffer from the highest rates of kidney and diabetes in the world, kidney disease. How many of us know someone who's on dialysis? How many of us know who's someone who's waiting for a life-saving transplant? There is help. We save 100 lives every day in the U.S. because of organ donation. Right now in New Mexico, one in five people waiting for a life-saving transplant is Native American. There are more than 600 people waiting for life-saving gifts and 100,000 people across the U.S. waiting for those gifts. Most oftentimes, those gifts come from donor heroes people who have passed and who have chosen to save others' lives in their passing. Donor heroes like Dulce and Sabrina Wero and Anthony. The Wero family is Danae from Bloomfield. They lost their brother, Sean, who was 32 when he passed. He's been gone 14 years ago yesterday. Sabrina also is a living donor to her father. I'd like to also recognize Renee and her husband, Leon Roybal from San Ildefonso Pueblo. Renee is a heart recipient. Her heart came from an 11-year-old girl, and we can say that Renee is truly young at heart and keeps us all on our toes. And we would be nowhere without those who work so hard to serve our Native American communities. People like Darren Magdalena, who is from Jemez and works with us at New Mexico Donor Services. Jennifer Hawthorne, who is Navajo from the Navajo Nation 
and works in the Transplant Center at UNMH. Leroy Begay, who's also Navajo and works at NNMC at the Shiprock Hospital. As we just said, Dr. Matthews is a liver recipient. 12 years ago, her friend, her dear friend saved her life. And because of her, she's never stopped dancing and is able to put on this amazing show and wonderful culture for all of us. You can help, you can save a life. Anyone can register to be an organ donor when you renew your driver's license or by simply scanning the QR code on that sign or visiting registerme.org. We are, as an organization, able to honor traditional burial customs and cultural beliefs. If you have questions, come see us. We're in the Creative Arts Center, or you can find us at donatelifenm.org. We must continue to save lives and preserve our culture. That's what's important, saving lives in our community. I thank you all for your attention and your time today, and we hope you have an amazing gathering of nations. Thank you. All right, how about another round of applause for Selena and the organization here. Thank you very much. We're gonna ask our um, show time to stand by. You're gonna have song number one. They're requesting a straight song. Young Spirit, stand by for song number two. You're gonna get a sidestep. When we get to the contest, we want all the judges in the middle. It's gonna be a big group couple of groups so get in the middle and you're gonna hand pick five so dance hard everybody make yourself seen and from those five there'll probably be two groups and those five will come back right after to dance off the finals okay we need Josie Sheena Carol Alexa and Lisa if you would please come on into the center of the arena Okay, I believe there's two groups. Our arena directors are counting them out. Again, on behalf of the Power Committee, we want to say thank you to the, uh, the organization for being here this afternoon. You can look them up online for more information, more details, or come up here and uh, visit with uh, Selena. All right, we got the high sign anytime you're ready. Showtime, make him dance.
right, trainers, give them a quick sip of water before we get into our second song. Young Spirit, stand by. Get us a good sidestep lined up. It's good to see Brother Jacob in the house this weekend. Aho. I believe they have some gear for sale, too. <laughs> Good dancing there, ladies. You'll have one more song. Boy, I tell you what, it's good to be here in Albuquerque, New Mexico this weekend. Enjoying myself here with all my friends and relatives. All righty, how we looking, Cricket? All righty, here we go. Young Spirit, take it away. Make him dance. applause for group number one. All right, ladies, hold your position. Our uh, judges are going to come on out and pick one dancer. So dancers, hold your position. I believe there's one, two, three, Yep, I believe we uh, have all of our, our finalists. The other dancers, you may be excused out of the arena. Thank you for coming out and participating on behalf of the, uh, the uh, Matthews family here and the uh, organization. Good job, ladies, good job. Group number two, if you would please come on in. going to ask Showtime to start with our sidestep this time, and then uh, Young Spirit, you'll finish up with our straight song for group number two. Man, oh man, we have some really good dancers in the house this weekend. Thank you, ladies, for coming out. <clears throat> uh -huh. 
Some champions in the house. the high sign we're gonna swing and sway the showtime way put your put your Let him hear it, ladies and gentlemen. That was song number one. Trainers, give him a quick drink of water. You know, friends and relatives, I want to share a little, uh, a little something that's on my heart at this time. You know, a few years back, I was up there at uh, Hinkley, Minnesota, attending their uh, their annual powwow, and uh, the late Larry Smallwood, Amick, he shared a story with me about this. Uh, this style of dance and what it meant, how it came about and where it come from. And tonight, you know, I just feel good that it, it kind of fits in with what we got going on here, you know, prayers for those individuals that are in need and prayers for those that went on to the spirit world. I just wanted to say that much. Stand by their young spirit. We're going to finish up with a straight song here. But this medicine dress is very powerful. And what we're doing right now, it's, it's a perfect time. We got the high sign. Take it away, Young Spirit. Song number two.
Oh my goodness, how about that, ladies and gentlemen? Thank you, young spirit. All right, ladies, hold your spot. Our five judges are gonna come out here and pick five finalists. After that, our top 10 will be dancing to that last and final song. We're gonna be asking uh, Showtime to stand by with a sidestep. There's one, there's two. I believe we're waiting on one more. And there's our last dancer for the top 10. Thank you ladies for coming out being a part of this uh, special contest here. Sponsored by Dr. Lita Matthews. Honoring organ donors and recipients. So thank you, thank you. All right, we need those, uh, those other five finalists to stand by, come on back into the arena. Stand by their showtime. We also want those teen boy categories to stand by. We're going to be coming back to you to finish up this uh, Friday afternoon. ladies here they train all year long they're all in shape not like us southern straight dancers we eat a salad on Wednesday we're ready to go Thursday we do about 10 push-ups Friday comes and we're locked and loaded hey. <laughs> let's see I see one two three four five six seven eight nine All right, we should have 10 dancers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You guys ready to go? All right, our judges are ready. I think they're ready. Lisa Meaches, are you ready? <laughs> All right, we got the thumbs up. Take it away, showtime!
Make some noise for our top 10 finalists right here in Tingley Coliseum. Come on up here, ladies, make a straight line and face Central Avenue. Hey, don't even know if Central's that way. I just know there's something going on on Central. Hey. <laughs> face McDonald's. No, I was kidding. Oh, that's North. Face Blake's Lauterburger. Ooh, that's what I had for breakfast. Came out here for my green chili fix. Yeah. Yeah. That burrito was thick. Our judges over here, they're, uh, they're exchanging notes. Yeah, this could be very difficult, especially when you have a lot of uh, championship dancers on the floor at one time. Oh, my goodness. But uh, there's going to be three places paid out in the uh, Dr. Lita Matthews uh, special here, honoring the organ donors and recipients. We also say thank you to Showtime and Young Spirit. For those beautiful songs, man, oh man. Those songs made me want to dance. Hey. Brother Russ in the house. He's got some Russ wear. Up for grabs. But yeah, we're gonna be starting with our uh, our third place winner. Our judges are over here talking it out. Joaquin. Yes. When when you talk about Russell's Russ wear, it's it's not the dentalium necklace set. It's his black socks. Ooh. Sexy. <laughs> yeah, it's good to see you, brother. All right, here is your third place winner. We have Randy Medicineberg. Come on out here and pick our third place winner on behalf of our judges and the family here. Osarone. Pigeon Lake, Alberta, Canada. Here's your second place winner. Your second place winner. Come on over this way. Blase. Wase. Two Thunders from Milwaukee, Miss Wisconsin. Hey. I got tongue tied there for a minute. All right, here's your champion. In the Dr. Lita Matthews special here. First place. Ooh, it's getting tricky. Your champion, Jonna Grace Brady from Newtown, North Dakota. Congratulations. All right. Yeah, she just became the Miss Indian Oklahoma University last weekend. Ooh. All right, on behalf of uh, Dr. Lita Matthews and the Power Committee.